Call interview, take one. Why did I want to be an actor? I'm trying to think of a good way to phrase this. I first knew that I wanted to be an actor at a very young age. Uh, I was performing for my Cub Scouts and it was a night of skits and it was they were really funny skits and everyone was laughing at me and I made a decision and I said this is what I want to do for the rest of my life. I want to be an actor. As a young boy I had a lot of passion to be in front of people, to be in front of an audience, uh, to perform and that passion has only grown throughout the years. Having a nine to five schedule didn't work for me. I needed an outlet to have to to put out my creative side. Acting for me is was fun. It just made sense. To become an actor, you have to have passion for the work. I think that was just inside me. It was just it's just who I am. Being an actor can be tough. It can be erratic, which means that my my schedule is never set. I could be doing a shoot in the morning and having a rehearsal at night, and then the next day I could be having three auditions throughout the day. The audition process can be uh, tough and draining because that's the real work. You have to be really uh, motivated to get yourself up every, every day to get out there and, and give it your all. You have to have a lot of determination and a lot of patience. I started out uh, trained in theater when I was in school, which is why when I started working professionally, I was taking on a lot of theater work. As the years went by, I started doing commercials and films, uh, which means I was better able to uh, support myself because they, they pay a lot more. Worst acting job, oh boy. <laughs> okay, I'll, all right, I got something for you. I got hired by an amusement park to work on this outdoor staged show where I was portraying a mad scientist. It was a kid's show and I had to go out there in the summer in the sweltering heat and with this huge Einstein wig and perform. That was my least favorite job. My favorite acting job was probably a show. Uh, it's, uh, it was a Shakespeare show, um, Midsummer Night's Dream. I, I did that on the Boston Common. There was about 10,000 people a night watching me, laughing at me. There's no, no experience compares to that. The best part of, of being an actor is that, that feeling that you've really, you've really done something with a role. You've really done some nice work and then if it's film getting to see it uh, that's that's a lot of fun to be an actor some traits uh, you have to have a strong sense of determination and a lot of patience because it's it's a hard lifestyle someone who has a lot of expression would be a good actor uh, someone who has a really strong voice would be a great actor. Uh, someone who uh, enjoys attention would be a great actor. Someone who doesn't enjoy being in the spotlight would not be a good actor. Uh, someone who needs job security would not be a good actor. In five to ten years, I, I would hope that my acting career has, has become fuller. More auditions per week. I'm doing theater more often. That's all I can hope for, really. More work. I think I will always be an actor. I, I've done it this long. I have a strong support system. My family and my friends, they're behind me 100%. I can't see myself doing anything else.